With Orion, America is building a new spacecraft for exploration. It could involve missions to the moon, missions to an asteroid, missions to Mars, and we want Orion to be able to do all those things, to take four astronauts into deep space and return them safely to the Earth. Before we can send astronauts into space on Orion, we have to test all of its systems. And there's only one way to know if we got it right. Fly it in space. For Orion's first flight, no astronauts will be aboard. The spacecraft is loaded with sensors to record and measure all aspects of the flight in every detail. It all begins with launch. For the first time in more than 40 years, this nation is going to launch a spacecraft intended to carry humans beyond low Earth orbit. That's a big deal. This is a, a really it's exciting and important mission for us. Uh, we will, in the future, be putting our astronauts on board, and uh, we're testing some of the highest risks. Big picture, progress is real and it's tangible, and if you're driving around the Kennedy Space Center, you can see it. Um, it's happening, and it's happening fast. So we're really excited for the EFT-1 launch this week. It's certainly a major step um, in our deep space exploration plan to put astronauts on Mars.